Hi guys, welcome to Sabonzi Academy. In this video, we'll be solving question 6 of the 2020 June Wasi Koma Theory questions. Okay, so question 6a. Copy and complete the table of values for the relation y is equal to 7 cos x minus 3 sin x. So let's begin with the solution for our question 6. Now we are asked to copy and complete. So we have x and y. So we have 0 degrees. 120 degrees and 150 degrees 7.0 minus 3.0 so we are completing the table so given the expression y is equal to 7 cos x minus 3 sin x okay so when x is equal to 30 y will be equal to 7 cos 30 minus 3 sine 30. And when you punch this on your calculator, you should get 4.6. So we write 4.6 here. Now when x is 60, our y will be equal to 7 cos 60 minus 3 sin 60 and when you do this you should get 0 0.90 so we put 0 0.90 here now you do it for all values of x and this should give us so this will be our complete table so this is question 6e now 6b Using a scale of 2 cm to 30 degrees on the x-axis and a scale of 2 cm to 2 units on the y-axis, draw the graph of y is equal to 7 cos x minus 3 sin x. This will be our axis. So this would be our y-axis. Since we don't have negative values of x, we can ignore the negative x side. So... This will be our x. And we are using 2 centimeters to 30 degrees on the x-axis. So we have 30 degrees, 60 degrees, 90 degrees, 120 degrees, and 150 degrees. So this is our x. And we are using 2 centimeters to 2 units on the y. So we have... 2, 4, 6, 8, and 10. Then we have negative 2, negative 4, negative 6, negative 8, and negative 10 here. Now, when we plot our points, we know that when x is 0, y is 7. So 7 will be here. When x is 30, our y is 4.6. So 4.6 will be somewhere here. When x is 60, our y will be 0 0.90. So 0 0.90 will be somewhere here. When x is 90, our y is negative 3. So negative 3 will be somewhere here. When our x is 120, our y is negative 6.1. So negative 6.1 will be here. And when x is 150, our y is negative 7.6. Negative 7.6 will be somewhere here. So if you should draw a curve, you have something like this. Okay. So this is what our curve will look like. So that will be it for question 6b. Now to question 6c, use the graph to solve the equations i, 7 cos x is equal to 3 sin x. So ci, 7 cos x is equal to 3 sin x. Now we can rewrite this as 7 cos x minus 3 sin x is equal to 0. But we know that 
y is equal to 7 cos x minus 3 sin x. And we have 7 cos x minus 3 sin x here. So we can represent this with y. So y is equal to 0. So now we find the value of x when y is equal to 0. So basically we are finding the value of x when the curve touches the x line. So this will be the point as y is equal to 0, this point. So then we can see that when y is equal to 0, our x is equal to... So this is... If you do it correctly, you should get 62 degrees. So our x is 62 degrees. Now moving on to the CII. Solve 7 cos x is equal to 3.2 plus 3 sin x. So 7 cos x is equal to 3.2 plus 3 sin x. Now this can be written as 7 cos x minus 3 sin x is equal to 3.2. But we know that 7 cos x minus 3 sin x is y. So y will be equal to 3.2. So this is y. So this is our y axis. Now y equals 3.2 will be somewhere here. So we draw from here to touch the curve. And then we find... So this will be our value when y is equal to 3.2. So we can say that when y is equal to 3.2, x is equal to 42 degrees. So this point, when you do it well, you should get 42 degrees. Okay, so this brings us to the end of question six. Now, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have questions, don't hesitate to leave them in the comment section as well. In our next video, we'll be solving the question seven of the 2020 Commerce Wasi theory questions.